Welcome to today's episode of Forbidden Science. I'm your host, Billy Carson, and today we're going to dive deep into the most fascinating phenomena in the cosmos, and it's called black holes. We're going to explore their origins, the enigmatic Hawking's radiation, the tantalizing possibility of Einstein Rosen bridges, and even their potential applications for space travel and portal technology. Plus, we'll touch on groundbreaking discoveries by NASA and talk about X-Point portals. So buckle up and prepare for a journey to the edge of space-time. To begin, let's talk about the origins of black holes. At their core, black holes are regions of space where gravity is so intense, nothing, not even light, can escape. Most black holes form when massive stars exhaust their nuclear fuel and collapse under their own gravity, compressing into a singularity. And then they become an infinitely dense point. Surrounding this singularity is the event horizon, the point of no return. There are also supermassive black holes which sit at the centers of galaxies, including our own Milky Way. These titans have masses millions or even billions times that of our sun, and their origins remain a hot topic of research. Were they seeded by the collapse of massive gas clouds in the early universe, or did they grow over billions of years by consuming stars and gas? The jury is still out, but their presence shapes galaxies and their evolution. Black holes were once thought to be eternal, but in the 1970s, the brilliant physicist Stephen Hawking turned this idea on its head. He proposed that black holes emit what we now call Hawking radiation. This radiation arises from quantum effects near the event horizon. Here's a simplified explanation. The vacuum of space isn't empty. It's teeming with virtual particles and pairs that pop in and out of existence. Near the event horizon, one particle on the pier can fall into the black hole while the other escapes. This escaping particle becomes radiation, effectively stealing energy from the black hole itself. Over immense timescales, this process causes black holes to lose mass and eventually evaporate entirely. It's a scary thought to think that the supermassive black hole at the center of the Milky Way galaxy will one day evaporate and disappear, which would end the life of our galaxy itself. Have you ever heard of an Einstein-Rosen bridge? In layman terms, we're calling them wormholes. Next, let's venture into the realm of Einstein's general relativity and its implication for black holes. In 1935, Albert Einstein and Nathan Rosen proposed the concept of a bridge between two points in space-time, what we now call an Einstein-Rosen bridge or a wormhole. Imagine a tunnel with two ends, each located at different points in space and time. Theoretically, such a structure could connect distant regions of space in the universe or even connect to other universes. While this may be captivating, wormholes remain hypothetical. The extreme conditions near black holes, including their singularities, might allow for such bridges, but their stability is questionable. Exotic matter with negative energy density might be needed to help keep them open. The idea of wormholes has inspired science fiction and advanced theoretical physics, fueling our imagination about interstellar travel. A lot of work has been done at CERN, at the LHC, the Large Hadron Collider in Switzerland, the largest machine in the world where they smash atoms together. Now, one of the actual implications of doing this are creating microscopic black holes. At first, the scientific community and citizens of the world got really panicked thinking that the Earth might collapse into one of these black holes. They did the science experiment anyway, and they did create microscopic black holes. However, they evaporated so rapidly, nothing can get in. But they did create the hypothetical black holes nonetheless, so we know that they are actually real. Imagine if we could harness wormholes or other properties of black holes, the implications for space travel would be revolutionary. Imagine traversing vast cosmic distances in only seconds, sidestepping the limitations of light speed travel. Scientists and engineers are also looking at the energy potentials of black holes. Rotating black holes, known as Kerr black holes, could theoretically be used to extract energy via the Penrose process. This method involves sending matter into the ergosphere, a region outside the event horizon, where it gains energy before being ejected. Although these ideas are speculative, 
Advancements in quantum physics and astrophysics might one day unlock technologies that leverage these cosmic giants. One day when we become a type 2 civilization, we will be able to harness energy directly from the supermassive black hole at the center of the Milky Way galaxy itself. Let's turn to something closer to home, something called X-Points. In 2014, NASA's Themis spacecraft and Europe's cluster probes discovered a region where Earth's magnetic field connects with the Sun's magnetic field. These X-Points create pathways for high energy particles to flow between the Earth and the Sun essentially natural portals. While these portals are fleeting and unstable, their discovery opens the door to studying magnetic reconnection and its role in space weather. Could understanding X points one day inspire stable artificial portals? Scientists are intrigued and the exploration of this phenomena might redefine what's possible in space travel and energy transfer. Now, as we wrap up, Black holes compel us to ponder profound questions about the universe and our place within it. They challenge our understanding of physics, general relativity, and quantum mechanics. They also spark our curiosity, pushing humanity to explore beyond our solar system. The discoveries of Hawking radiation, the potential of Einstein Rosenbridges, and NASA's X-Points remind us that the universe is filled with untapped mysteries and opportunities. These phenomena also deepen our understanding of time dilation, particularly in the context of black holes where the extreme warping of space-time causes time to slow down dramatically near the event horizon. If black holes are the ultimate enigma, they might be nature's ultimate key to the future. Thank you for joining us on this cosmic journey through the mystery of black holes. This has been another amazing episode of Forbidden Science with Billy Carson. Until next time, keep looking and wondering to what lies beyond the stars. Watch this video for free at www.4bk.tv or download the app on your smartphone, Fire Stick app, Samsung TV, Roku, and other app providers.